First of all, I want to greet you and also want to express sense of gratitude to participate in this conference as a presenters. Um, today I'm going to present you uh, my topic. Uh, this is the blood group antigens and antibodies in the newborn. He is mentioned the co-authors of this um, uh, our articles uh, and they belong and affiliated to universities. This is the the Batumi Shotarosawli State University, Batumi, Georgia, and the uh, International University of uh, BAO, which is also is located in a general region of the Georgia. Uh, first of all, I want to show you the content of our uh, presentation file. This is the introduction, methodology, results, and discussions, conclusions, acknowledge, and also it's including the references. I want to tell you a few words about the introduction. Uh, as uh, everybody knows, ABO blood group determined by the presence of A and B antigens on the erythrocytes and also in case of ABO blood group um, uh, is present also natural type of antibodies. This is the NTA and NTB antibodies and these antibodies is present in the serum. Erythrocyte natural antibodies are immunoglobin M type. And usually they don't present in newborns. Uh, and uh, usually they are appear in the first life of um, first year life of um, um, postnatal life. Unlike adults, in some newborns, antigen A and antigen B are not well expressed. They are fully expressed. In some cases, antibodies may be absent in the blood serum. Why these antigens are not um, expressed well? Because the antigen are not product directly product of the genes. First is going the um, synthesis of transferase, which change the uh, features of the uh, primary erythrocyte. Um, receptors uh, and this is the multi-step process at the say at the um, um, age of the newborn age they are not well expressed and in some cases um so it showed the weak agglutination reaction uh, what about the rh antibodies rh antibodies is well expressed in newborn in the same way as it's it uh, appear in adult because these antigens are the um, not carbohydrates they are the proteins and we can say that they are the direct product of the genes. Uh, we, we are interested to find these characteristics in our regions, uh, newborns. Um, what is the, our research methodologies? Um, uh, first of all, I want to take my attention about the research materials. Newborns blood um, samples we are collected from two clinics. This is a uh, yeah, yeah, surely, but to me, maternal and child central hospital, and another one, Iris Porchashrili Health Center Medina, both of them located in Nigeria region. A total of 208 newborns blood samples was collected in the current study. The only one inclusion criteria followed was that subject must be less than one month old. The current research was carried out of the Laboratory of Immunogenetic and Biosafety of the Department of Biology of the Natural uh, Faculty of Natural Science and Health um, uh, Care of Batumi Shotarostavel State University. Uh, which research, uh, research method we used um, uh, during the um, research. Uh, this uh, is a determination of the ABU blood group in newborns. We used uh, the agglutination uh, process methodologies, both forward and reverse blood typing procedure we, we are performed. Uh, forward for detection of the antigens and reverse for detection antigens as well the natural antibodies. We use monoclonal anti-A, anti-B, anti-A1 lectin and anti-A each lectin antibodies for typing the ABO blood group antigen. And also the standard erythrocyte with A and the standard erythrocyte with B blood group 
in the newborn plasma, we are taken for reverse methods for the ABO natural antibodies type B. Uh, statistical analysis, analysis was performed using the statistical package for the social science SPSS software. Uh, P-value 0.05 were considered statistically significant. We also used the special calculatory platform uh, and the link is um, shown below. Uh, what about the results? Uh, in these slides are shown ABO blood group distribution in the studied newborns. Based on this table, uh, the total number of the newborns was 208 and uh, uh, majority of them, 43.75, belongs to O blood group. After followed the A blood group and distribution of this um, phenotypical characteristic is uh, 41.35. B blood group uh, have uh, only 21 studied newborns and prevalence of this uh, uh, phenotypical characteristic in our studied newborns where 10.10. Um, 10. Uh, the less distributed characteristic has a bio blood group, only 10 uh, newborns out of 208, which is the 4.8% have a bio blood group characteristic. We confirm our results, the distribution of the uh, ABO blood group in the uh, blood group, uh, uh, blood donors. Uh, in our previous study, we already uh, studied the distribution of these antigens in the region, newborns, uh, in regions, uh, blood donors. Uh, and the total number of the blood donors was 109. And uh, here we can see that uh, Mm, half of um, our studied donor carried out the O blood group uh, after its follow A, B, and AB blood group. Uh, only for uh, 47 uh, donors out of 109 belong to the AB O blood group. Uh, AB blood group. Uh, what about the ABO blood group antigens and antibodies? Which, which antigens is present in A, B, A, B, and O blood group cases? Uh, when person have a, a blood group characteristic in the erythrocyte surface, they have A blood group. What about the antibodies in the plasma? There are antibi. In case of a blood group, B antigens is present and in the plasma anti A antibodies. What about A B blood group? This is the codominance characteristic. Both of the antigens are expressed in the surface of erythrocyte, but what about the, in the serum? There is not um, uh, anti antibodies in the serum. So what about the O blood group? In this case, is A and B antigens is not present in the erythrocyte surface. What about the, in the plasma? Both of the uh, antibodies is NTA and S NTB is present in the serum. But uh, what we can describe in our studied donors here is shown O blood group newborns, our studied newborns. Total number of um, them were uh, 19. One, uh, and uh, among them, we uh, sub make the subgroup um, uh, of the newborns. One, uh, we are um, uh, both of NTA and NTAB is antibody was present. Only NTA antibodies after is coming only NTB antibodies. And uh, another one is when these antibodies, none of them present in the serum. As um, are shown from the table, uh, is 38.46 uh, uh, percentage cases in our study the uh, newborns have both antibodies in the serum look like as an adult. What about the case of uh, only anti-A antibodies? Uh, uh, only 19 newborns out of 91 uh, studied newborns have uh, this characteristic. This is the 20% uh, case. Uh, uh, what about the next categories? 
nine out of 91 studied newborns have only anti B antibodies um, in the serum. And this is approximately 10%. Uh, what about that um, uh, antibodies is not present in the serum? Uh, 28 um, newborns out of 91 studied newborns have this characteristic. And this is um, quite high percentage, this is a 30.77%. Uh, what about the statistical, um, uh, this um, statistical information regarding this one? We have here DF uh, degrees of freedom three. What about the critical volume? Is the uh, 7.815 and this is um, uh, quite less uh, to confia with the chi square which is equal to 16.6 in this um, slide we can see um, confia uh, this result to the uh, donors as i told you we studied the 100 uh, 1009 uh, nine um, uh, blood donors. Among them, 504 have O blood group specificity. And all cases of all blood group donors <clears throat> in the serum have anti-A and anti-B antibodies. In other cases, we don't have the other categories, only anti-A, anti-B, and none of them in the uh, serum, which is a pure into the neonate stage. Uh, now what about the anti-B antibodies expression in the A blood group newborns? Uh, totally, we have um, 86 newborns with A specific A, a anti a blood group. Uh, and um, here we can subdivide two uh, groups. This is the presence of anti-B antibodies and don't present of the anti-B antibodies. Uh, present of anti B antibodies look like as the adult is appear as the 35 newborns out of 86. Uh, this is the 40.7 percentage case. And in majority cases, um, uh, in approximately 60% cases, anti B antibodies is not expressed in A blood group newborns. Uh, nine, uh, 51 um, newborns out of 86 uh, uh, A blood group studied newborns don't have uh, these antibodies. Degrees of freedom in these cases is the one. Critical volume is quite less to confirm that chi-square. Chi-square is equal to 400, uh, excuse me, 44.4. And here is shown the <clears throat> comparison of the newborns uh, antibodies uh, production with to the adults. As I already told you, we studied 1,009 uh, blood donors in region. Among them, 349 have a blood group specific city. And all newborns, all the blood donors uh, in the plasma with a blood group has um, anti-B antibodies. But in these cases, we can see that in newborns have two categories. What about the um, B blood group characteristic? Uh, in our study donor uh, with B blood group, we study the anti-A antibodies expression. And here is also uh, our result give us opportunity to divide it to so subgroups here, presence and don't present of anti-A antibodies. Uh, only uh, 30 uh, case out of 21 uh, of the B blood group um, uh, newborns uh, have anti-B antibodies, anti-A antibodies. This is the 61.9%. Uh, and eight uh, newborns with B blood group specificity don't have this um, anti-A antibodies. This is the 38.1%. Uh, uh, degrees of freedom in this case is one. Critical volume is the uh, 3.84 and um, chi square is quite high than the critical volume. It's equal to 11. Here is also shown the 
distribution of uh, these anti A antibodies in the B blood group donors and confiable to the neonates. Uh, in the um, uh, blood uh, donors, uh, which is uh, uh, 109 in uh, B blood group specificity, in 100 cases, percent cases have anti A antibodies in the plasma. Uh, what about the subgroup um, distribution characteristic in the blood um, uh, of the newborns? Uh, in A and AB blood group, the newborns, we studied also subgroups of A. This is the A1, A2. And based on this one, we can make uh, four um, uh, subdivision subgroups. This is the A1, A2 in A blood group persons, uh, newborns, and A1B and A2B in AB blood group newborns. As we can see from the picture, the distribution of the A2 subgroups is more higher than A1 subgroups in newborns. But it's not shown that um, this is the real distribution of the A2 uh, subgroups in the newborns because this uh, will be changed in postnatal life. And next, our uh, research item is to detect these antigens and antibodies in the postnatal life, especially in the third and the uh, six months of the uh, postnatal life. In these cases, degrees of freedom is three, critical volume 7.81, and it's are less than the chi-square, which is more than 100. Uh, what about the conclusion of our research? Our research shows that in majority case of the newborns, ABO, Antibodies are not expressed, and also we found that predominance of the A2 and A uh, to B phenotypes in the newborn, since the postnatal period of development is required for the full expression of the ABO system antigens. Uh, I want to thank them and tell that the current research work is done on the basis of Patumishotarosawa State University targeted grant project, evaluation of the immune genetic characteristic of the heterocyte blood group antigens antibodies of the newborns. And this is the references. If you have any questions, please contact us. Thank you very much once more time.